In computing, the executable and linkable format is a common standard file format for executables, object code, shared libraries, and core dumps. First published in the System V application binary interface specification, and later in the tool interface standard, it was quickly accepted among different vendors of Unix systems. In 1999 it was chosen as the standard binary file format for Unix and Unix-like systems on x86 by the 86 Open Project. ELF is flexible and extensible by design, and it is not bound to any particular processor or architecture. This has allowed it to be adopted by many different operating systems on many different platforms. File Layout Each ELF file is made up of one ELF header, followed by file data. The file data can include, program header table, describing zero or more segments, section header table, describing zero or more sections, data referred to by entries in the program header table or section header table, the segments contain information that is necessary for runtime execution of the file, while sections contain important data for linking and relocation. Any byte in the entire file can be owned by at most one section, and there can be orphan bytes which are not owned by any section. File header, the ELF header defines whether 32 or 64 bit addresses are to be used. The header itself contains three fields that are affected by this setting and offset other fields that follow them. The 64 bit header is 64 bytes long. Tools, ReadElf is a Unix binary utility that displays information about one or more ELF files. A free software implementation is provided by GNU Bing Utils. Elf Utils provides alternative tools to GNU Bing Utils purely for Linux. Elf Dump is a command for viewing ELF information in an ELF file, available under Solaris and FreeBSD. Obdump provides a wide range of information about ELF files and other object formats. Obdump uses the binary file descriptor library as a backend to structure the ELF data. The Unix file utility can display some information about ELF files, including the instruction set architecture for which the code in a relocatable, executable, or shared object file is intended, or on which an ELF core dump was produced. Applications The ELF format has replaced older executable formats in various environments. It has replaced AART and COFF formats in Unix like operating systems, Linux, Solaris. IRIX, FreeBSD, NetBSD, OpenBSD, DragonflyBSD, Syllable, HPUX, QNX Neutrino, MINIX, ELF has also seen some adoption in non-Unix operating systems, such as, OpenVMS, in its Itanium version, BOS Revision 4 and later for x86-based computers. Haiku, the open-source re-implementation of BOS. Risk OS, some game consoles also use ELF, PlayStation Portable, PlayStation 2, PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, GP2X, Dreamcast, GameCube, Worry, other operating systems running on PowerPC using ELF, Amiga OS 4, the ELF executable has replaced the previous EHF which was used on Amigas equipped with PPC processor expansion cards. Morphos. AROS, some operating systems for mobile phones and mobile devices use ELF, Symbian OS V9 uses E32 image format that is based on the ELF file format. Sony Ericsson, for example, the W800i, W610, W300, etc. Siemens, the SGOLD and SGOLD2 platforms, from Siemens C65 to S75 and BenQ Siemens E71 slash EL71. Motorola, for example, the E398, SLVRL7, V360, V3i, Bada, for example, the Samsung Wave S8500. Nokia phones or tablets running the Memo or the Mego OS, for example, the Nokia N900. Android uses ELF so libraries for the Java native interface. Some phones can run ELF files through the use of a patch that adds assembly code to the main firmware, which is a feature known as ELF pack in the underground modding culture. The ELF file format is also used with the Atmel AVR, 
AVR32 and with Texas Instruments MSP430 microcontroller architectures. Some implementations of open firmware can also load DLF files, most notably Apple's implementation used in almost all power PC machines the company produced. Specifications 86 Open 86 Open was a project to form consensus on a common binary file format for Unix and Unix-like operating systems on the common PC-compatible x86 architecture, so as to encourage software developers to port to the architecture. The initial idea was to standardize on a small subset of Spec 1170, a predecessor of the single Unix specification, and the GNUC library to enable unmodified binaries to run on the x86 Unix-like operating systems. The project was originally referred to as Spec 150. The format eventually chosen was ELF, specifically the Linux implementation of ELF, after it had turned out to be a de facto standard supported by all involved vendors and operating systems. The group started email discussions in 1997 and first met in person at the Santa Cruz Operation Offices on August 22, 1997. The steering committee was Mark Ewing, Dion Johnson, Evan Labovich, Bruce Perrins, Andrew Roach, Brian Sparks and Linus Torvalds. Other people on the project were Tim Bird, Keith Bostick, Chuck Craner, Michael Davidson, Chris G. Demetria, Ulrich Trepper, Don Duggar, Steve Jeinsberg, John Mad Dog Hall, Ron Holt, Jordan Hubbard, Dave Jensen, Keen Johnston, Andrew Josie, Robert Leip, Bela Lubkin, Tim Marsland, Greg Page, Ronald Joe Record, Tim Ruckel, Joel Silverstein, Kaya Pai Ten, and Eric Troen. Operating systems and companies represented were BOS, BSDI, FreeBSD, Intel, Linux, NetBSD, SEO, and SunSoft. Incorporated, the project progressed and in mid-1998, SCO began developing Alexa UN, an open-source compatibility layer capable of running Linux binaries on open server, Unixware, and Solaris. SCO announced official support of Alexa UN at Linux World in March 1999. Sun Microsystems began officially supporting Alexa UN for Solaris in early 1999 and has since moved to integrated support of the Linux binary format via Solaris containers for Linux applications. With the BSDs having long supported Linux binaries and the main x86 Unix vendors having added support for the format, the project decided that Linux ELF was the format chosen by the industry and declare, D, itself dissolved on July 25, 1999. Fat Elf, Universal Binaries for Linux FAT ELF is an ELF binary format extension which adds FAT binary capabilities. It is aimed for Linux and other Unix-like operating systems. Additionally to the CPU architecture abstraction, there is the potential advantage of software platform abstraction for example binaries which support multiple kernel ABI's versions. A proof of concept Ubuntu 9.04 image and development tools are available. As of 2014, Support for Fat Elf is not integrated in the Linux kernel mainline. See also Comparison of executable file formats, Portable executable, Dwarf, a format for debugging data, Application binary interface, VDSO, Virtual DSO, References. Further reading External links <laughs>